Yes, hello everybody. Hope you have an amazing day. Today we are going to talk about the gastrics or the stomach, which has a lot of cells and it's going to take actually two to three videos to explain almost all of it. So let's not waste time, let's get started with the uh, stomach. All right, uh, the stomach uh, is the uh, dilated uh, segment of the digestive tract, which receives food from the esophagus then undergoes mechanical and chemical breakdown to form the chyme. So um, actually, the stomach has a lot of functions. Um, the stomach has four regions, the cardiac, fundus, body, and pylorus. Because the fundus and the body are identical in microscopic structures, the stomach has uh, such as logical parts, only the cardiac, funduc, and uh, fundic, and pylori. The cardiac, it's the one on the top, the, fundu, the fundus or the fundic is the one that is uh, just below just below the cardiac part and including the body and the pylori part, which is the lower part of the stomach. The wall of the stomach consists of four, four, four main layers, the mucosa, submucosa, muscularis, and serosa. Uh, let me say that again, uh, mucosa submucosa, muscularis, and serosa. These are the main layers of the stomach. The gastric mucosa has a complex relief, the uh, longitudinal folds, the gastric pits, and the mammillated areas. The longitudinal folds or uh, ridges are uh, termed that are uh, composed of the mucosa and submucosa. The gastric pits or the are also called the foveoli, are the invaginations of the epithelium into the lamina propria, which serve as the ducts of gastric glands. And the mammillated areas bulging irregularly or uh, irregular areas formed by grooves or shallow trains. The gastric mucosa consists of uh, the surface which is the epithelium, lamina propria, mescularis, these are the main three layers of the mucosa. The epithelium layer. The epithelium layer is a simple columnar and mucus secreting, while the lamina propria is composed of loose connective tissue. It is packed gastric glands. Uh, while the um, muscularis mucosa is well developed, and it consists of three layers of smooth muscle cells. The second layer, which is the submucosa. It consists of loose connective tissue, blood vessels, and submuscular nerve plaques and nerve plexus. The fourth layer is the muscularis, or the third layer is the muscularis. It com is composed of small, uh, of smooth uh, muscle cells, oriented in three layers: an inner oblique layer, middle circular, and outer uh, longitudinal layer. At the pyloris, the middle layer is greatly thickened to form the pyloric sphincter. Um, the last part, or the last uh, layer of the stomach is the serosa, which consists of a layer of squamous cells, also called the mesothelium, with a small amount of underlying connective tissue. Uh, this is for the first part, and the second part is going to be about the stomach glands, which is also going to take some time. Uh, and I hope to see you in the next video. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Alright, see you in the next video.